He's 26, and last year he earned $200,000 traveling the world playing tennis. He's rich, young, intelligent, and practically has to beat the girls off with a stick. But right now, all he wants in the world is to win his first major singles tournament. Maybe it'll be this one, the prestigious New South Wales Open. I mean, I can basically choose to live wherever I want to, and fortunately I have the financial security now that, you know, if I want to take a break somewhere, I can go there and do it. If I'm in a city, I can... I can wake up every morning, whatever time I want to wake up, no one, you know, I don't have to meet any deadlines or answer to anybody. I'm my own boss and I lead my own life. 30, 15. Paul McNamee is one of the new breed of young sporting superstars who know the world is their oyster and they're pretty cocky about it. 40, 15. But over on the next court here at White City is another of the young gods, Vetus Gerolitis. Ranked ninth in the world, he's McNamee's friend and arch rival. Each is watching out of the corner of his eye to see how the other's going. In their last four encounters, they've finished with two matches apiece, and they don't like being on equal footing. But first, they have to get rid of their opponents. Game, set, Mac, McNamee, two sets to love, seven, six, Six three. Thank you. Vetus and myself, it just so happens that we're both bachelors. Uh, obviously, we're playing a lot of the same tournaments together, and therefore, we both tend to like the same you know, night spots. We're not going to go into some sleazy little joint, you know, and hang out, you know, with broad. And so, uh, I run into Vetus quite a bit. But today, they're not dancing. One of them has to go. And it will be Gerolitis who draws first blood. But McNamee now knows the Gerolitis game pretty well. And he too will find touch quickly in this best of three sets match. It's a hot day, and Paul begins the process of wearing his opponent down with a mixture of shots, including his now devastating topspin lob. Oh, oh boy, what a shot! McNamee winning four games in succession. Five out of the last six. After two tough sets, Paul suddenly finds himself winning a run of points, which give him the heady scent of victory. A volley by 40, McNamee 30. brings up match point for Paul McNamee to advance to the quarterfinals. He's done it. McNamee in straight sets into the quarterfinals of the New South Wales Open. The duel is over, and Paul, who's put so much preparation into this battle, suddenly realises he could now win the war as well. With the strongest seed out of the way, the New South Wales Open could just be his.